would be Ganondorf would have taken over Hyrule. You know, you got this really right. But I mean, we we were at the Temple of Time, so we're at the Temple of Time. So you know, we're, we're living though. Oh. So ooh, and we we've have got someone. We got Ison Go Bay. Now Ison Go Bay, I don't know too much about him, but I do know he is a Fox main, uh -huh. and he's apparently the best player in Brazil. Whoa. So is that him on the left? This I, red fox. Honestly, I don't know which is which. I mean, Chain Ace, we've known for years. We've known Chain Ace for a long time. You know, is he still wearing that hat? Oh, he's hat. got the hat on. <laughs> That's uh, the like, same hat since Spock days. Yeah, and I remember like just meeting him. Like you meet so many players when you're when you're a gamer when you're in a fighting game community. And, right. Like you don't remember everybody's name, but Chain Ace always wore a hat that said Chain, Chain Ace. Ace on it, and you I appreciated it. it so much. I was like, "What's up, Chain Ace?" <laughs> It's like the first time I met him, I knew his name. It's so <laughs> amazing. But yeah, I mean, Chance has come a long way. Um, he used to be one of the guys that was known mostly for recording on yeah. uh, the East Coast. Yeah. And his his play wasn't really where a lot of people expected it. But he's slowly began breaking the gap, you know, and he's leveling up. So on and, that, and we're at winners, winners quarterfinals of pool B five. What is quarterfinals? That that means uh, two out of three. Yeah, and he's still in winners. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So Chase is going with his Falco though. Yeah. All pool play up until uh, finals. And finals is three out of five. Oh, sick. Yeah. It's pretty disgusting, but uh, we're going to see what happens with New Jersey's very own. He's basically a hometown hero. Hometown hero. Up against. Chain Ace. What does MGFC stand for? Uh, that's his sponsor. I'm not sure who. I know that Eggum is part of it, uh, Curb oh. is part of it, oh. uh, Strict Nine. Oh. So it's a pretty solid New Jersey team. Only Falco. I mean, Eggum, New know, Jersey Fox. Falco team. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like. Magnificent it, Falco Club. Dude, their Smash Fest must be so funny. They're just all sitting and they can just like <laughs> share controllers. It's just rematch, rematch, rematch. <laughs> Here we go. Starting off. And I really did want to see how. Uh, I can go Bay uh, performs this tournament because he's again, you know, we've had issues with the the out of the country uh, right. scene. You know, how right. can these guys perform on and a different level? Dude, I wonder how much pressure it is for him too. It's like you're representing your country. Country, yeah. But you wonder like how many people are back home and like actually like are following the scene. So like maybe it's not that much pressure. Maybe he just loves the game. Yeah. Oh, this is the edge guard. I, you know what? I think that's probably one of the things that probably lacks when you're when you're. Like the edge guard refinement here is just like so high level. Right. Like we practice our edge guards all the time versus really good players. And you playing wonder, against yeah. weird recovery is probably really hard if you're not used to it. Right. It takes so many games to get good at edge guarding. But we'll see. I mean, Dominant first off. Yeah. No, Chase, he's always he's fallen into some habits over the years. Yeah. He's really, really into these early areas. And especially if Ison Dobe has a uh, really, really good, uh, as he gets nicked by a back air, should finish up the stock. Ooh. But I mean, if Ison Dobe's out of shield game, especially with Shine Out of Shield, is on point, yeah. it could be Reynolds. It's spell disaster yeah. for our hometown hero. Oh, the grab. Oh, bear. Oh, I like the idea. Yeah. Falling on the platform to go for another grab it doesn't quite come together. Nice weak nair. Oh, but see, like again, no edge guard. That was like one of those situations where Falco is really vulnerable. No, I we think he was looking for the uh, upward angle, to yeah. get a bit more to a certain stage. Ooh, Ooh down, down smash. smash. That's a read. We yeah. got the reads. Certainly Ooh. speaking Portuguese right now. Yeah. <laughs> oh. The second shine knocks him back on stage. Oh, a, a nice idea by Genius, I think. Yeah, he gets misspaced in. Uh oh, good recovery by Aizen Bay. And I like what Aizen Bay did there. He rose with the down air, seeing God Chain's crouching. Woo! Oh my God! You know, are, are, is this Apex Legit 2014? <laughs> or is this the World Cup? <laughs> Ooh. I, I actually really love that forward smash. <laughs> I like love when somebody's moving around so fast, and then Falco just turns Plus around like, and kicks. I don't you. care. I don't care. <laughs> And like something else that I love about this game is the sounds that the characters make. Oh my god, this combo! Oh! I stopped even talking about Fox's sounds. That, that never happens. Oh. Once I get started about Fox and the way that, the way that he sounds, I never stop. Atta, atta. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, Chase was one of those guys who really admires Shiz and his play style. Yeah. Even taking on the yellow jacket. Yeah, for sure. I think that this is actually the coolest Falco, too. This is like the getting, getting work done Falco, you know? It's a Desert Danny. Yeah. 
Oh my god, that angle. Chain Ace went like almost straight down. Yeah. We got a really close game right now. Yeah, Chain Ace is definitely stuck. Oh! Up. I thought that was an F smash way that, to happen. That weak back air. If it, all right, if it was Shiz, that Shiz guy would have got smashed. Him. Yeah, he would have done something crazy. <laughs> what a weird nair. Oh straight my ahead. god. Ooh, what? Pineapple. Yeah, pineapple. SpongeBob SquarePants. Sponge, SpongeBob and Patrick are down there looking at it. Where, where, where's this fire coming from? Squidward's getting all mad. <laughs> <laughs> I love Squidward. See, and oh, I, back throw to fourth row. I really like what Chain did there. He messed up the L cancel. Realizing that he doesn't go for a shine, he goes for a grab just to mess up Icicle Bay. Smart stuff from him. Good eye, Frog. Oh, we got two bad air dodges right in the exact same spot. It's like Icicle Bay wanted to repeat. Oh! Double forward B. Doesn't get a tech chase. Icicle Bay is just like a bulldog right now. Yeah. Just threatening. And right now, Falco has, Falco has the advantage, but if Fox gets stage control, like, that all turns around. So this is really, like, a very even match still. Right, I mean, This is if, down to the wire, Power Shield. If Chain Ace gets uh, constrained to, like, a third or fourth of the stage, I think it's a route for him. Dude, Chain Ace keeps rolling away, and Isaac Obey doesn't know how to deal with it. If you see, he keeps not teching and just, like, slowly rolling. Oh, the patience! The standoff! Who's gonna blink first? That was a nice setup for me. Yeah. I like it. A weak hit for forcing the attack. I, I really like the way that he's that Isaac Obey is playing, and like I think that the more he plays, the better. Oh my God! Ate his jump, sniped it out. Chain Ace with no double jump. Chain one to Isaac Obey. Chain Ace is holding his own though. He is. So I, I really like the way that he's playing. He's like playing very patiently, and right. he's, he's really waiting for Chain Ace to make mistakes and like fall into his trap. Right. But it, it doesn't it doesn't seem like it's all coming together. But as you get better, I think that play style ends up being really powerful. Right. So he should keep going on the road that he's going and just... And who knows, maybe, you know, he's he's doing some nerves. We have a character change? From the winner. We got the eyes and go bay Marth right now. Okay, okay. Are we dual mains? I guess so. Yo, this cube is actually taking a really long time to load stages. It's really yeah, crazy. it's really weird. It's like not enough RAM on this cube. <laughs> like the, the 1994 model or whatever. Or Windows 3.1 GameCube right now. <laughs> Nintendo, we're not emulating, I promise. <laughs> we bought the real hardware, we love you we guys. We can show it to you. <laughs> we love you. Oh, power shield. Okay. I should go bay with these power shields, I love it. You know, that seems like to be a really, really uh, recurring thing from a lot of uh, players from outside the country. It's a really, really well spaced. Uh, forward tilt. Forward tilt to get underneath the laser. Yeah. Much of this is just an obscenely high laser from Chain Ace. Yeah. So. Oh. His waveland back was so far that he missed that grab. Isengo Bay wavelanded back. He looked like uh, Michael Jackson <laughs> walking. Well, I, mean, I didn't know I could do that. Of course, another you know, obscene Ooh, it's a range. Tipper yeah. setup doesn't go for it. Yeah. When we talk about you know those uh, MTFC guys, especially Strickland, their weaknesses tend to be Mark. Yeah. Um, Strickland especially. I remember Peach being like, "Oh, we can't be Peach." Somebody's playing Peach, may as well forfeit. Okay. Yeah. I'll see what's in losers bracket. Yeah, like Ryoko back in the day. This is probably beyond uh, over everybody's head, but you know Ryoko versus Egan. It was like oh God, Egan yes. would always outplace him if they didn't play each other. But as soon as they played, it was just like a wrap. Oh, next, <laughs> next, bands next. <laughs> oh God, remember those days? Isaac Obey just like slowly finding his way back to back to the solid ground. And he's sticking around and doing a pretty good job of that. Also, he's just extremely patient. Like, so patient. He's not afraid to stay look in the shield. Like, he's, look at this. It's kind of like when you're watching a nature show. They see a jaguar <laughs> walking through the jungle. Yeah, like very few approaches. And like even his um, his pressure when he's when Falco's waking up is like really, really reserved. Like I feel like he's never going to get hit by a get-up attack because he's never on top of you when you're, you know, when you're recovering. Very true. Yeah, super slow. Super patient. Chain A's charity sock. Yes, sir. Charity sock. We don't need those stocks. Oh, oh no! The Mutu King! Almost gets the Mutu King, but gets a trade. Up it's throw? Yet. No up tilt. And again, he's waiting for a chance to flinch. Yeah. yeah. I like his style. Yeah. One thing I like with Chain A's is he's really, really okay with disengaging. He's okay with hitting and running. Yeah, a lot of people need to learn how to do that better, I think. You're totally right. But yeah, if he polishes it up, I see a lot of potential in this Isaac Obey guy. 
Like, that up tilt was, like, the, exactly the right move. It's just, like, a, a fraction of a second too slow. So, uh, Chain Ace was able to get his shield up and get out of pressure. Oh, Chain Ace dipping. I'm out. We got lasers. Oh, oh. Chain Ace with the tag. I, I like that from Ice and Bay. Waiting for the stage to continue uh, yeah, yeah, changing. Yeah. That's kind of cool. grimy. It kind of grimy. Kind of grimy. Like when you got the guy grabbed, it's like, no, I don't know what the train's gonna look like. I'm gonna chill for a second. <laughs> you hang out here with me. Oh, goes for that read. Yeah. I think he thought he was gonna be on the stublet. That little lip on Pokemon Stadium when it's you're when you're in there. Off of, yeah. Oh, a down air. That Bob's boss head. is obscene. And look at you. I mean, look at Ice Bay. He he just went right in and just seized safety hole. He lost it, but it was it's a really good move. Oh my god. That was like the slowest down air. You see like how <laughs> slowly he went downwards? I wonder why. Ooh! Did you see that? He drifted back with that forward oh, yeah, air. Yeah. Moved out of the way of the down smash. Yeah, I mean of course a down smash does have invincibility on it. You see that grab range? Part's so good. And Ooh. I, the way, I like what he did there. He changed it up there. He actually followed him onto the platform instead of looking for the up tilt underneath him. Little dancing blade. Just a little thing. Just a tap. Just to show Falco he can change colors. Man, I can change colors. <laughs> Isn't that cool? Oh, laser forward tilt. I think that's one of the grimy things you can do as Falco. Right. If you're gonna be a grimy Falco, just start laser up tilting or forward tilting people. Yeah, just keep spacing them out. Lame. <laughs> oh, oh, the pressure. the pressure. But not oh, I have to go Bay watching him. It's like, okay, I've seen I am not movie. impressed. I've seen this movie before. Nair? That, that Nair was actually crazy. Power shield. Oh, we live it. Yeah, I mean, that's the MGFC. I hate to say the classic from them, but. <laughs> the classic. I rolled too early. Yeah, no. It happens too often from them. Guys, like Strict 9. They just want to play, man. I want to roll back on the stage. Push I, want to, I want to push more buttons. I'm tired of waiting here. And that's the life of Falco. Yeah. Gets hit off, weak hit. Oh. His jet, his jet booster just. Uh, the Star Fox team did not, they gave him like the backup one. <laughs> they gave Fox the good one, and then they gave Falco this like, the defective one. Hand me down from James McLeod. Reset, oh. yes. Oh, waits for the, the down dodge. And this is it. Oh! A sick combo to close the set. I think Obey is on his feet. 